hello welcome back to my channel this is my very first video of 2024 i hope that the new year um, like 2024 has been treating you well so far for me it's been great i have had i mean i feel 2023 was like really heavy um, and i have just had like crazy emotional roller coaster ride and now that i think of it i feel like for the last 3 years it's just been like that uh, but hopefully i'm really like fingers crossed i hope that 2024 is good and like a better year for all of us i just wanted to talk to you guys about my most worn pieces from 2023 i'm sure you must have already seen these pieces in my shorts and i i like to rewear my clothes a lot but having said that obviously this is like my most worn clothing pieces wala video so you'll see a lot of pieces that i've already shown in my videos you guys know my love for trousers if you have been around for a while you would know that i love wearing trousers and in my opinion and i think i can only talk for myself i think trousers are an integral part of my wardrobe i i just love them they're so versatile At the start of the year i discovered these pants which are beige in color i got them from h&m and i fell in love actually there were these other like a uh, kind of like muted brown color pants that i got in 2021 and ever since then i have been on a lookout for like same or like similar pants and nothing has come close uh, but these pants did and the moment um, i tried them i was like wow these are great uh, so slowly i got another one in black and i also got one in gray and i have another one in navy and i'm in love with all of them i'm of i have obviously not tried all of them for you guys but the black one i think is great you if if you want to like have something in your wardrobe it should be a black pant a gray pant and probably a navy pant uh, beige is optional i mean if you want you can definitely have beige as well uh, but these are really really cool i have worn them so 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 much uh, if you know like i think my personal style is very like uh, i wouldn't say business casual but i like wearing trousers because i think they are very comfortable compared to uh, and jeans i mean i like wearing jeans as well but um yeah i've slowly grown out of that phase and i love wearing trousers then to my surprise this year i did not really reach out so much to crop tops i wore a lot of like longer tops um and i all was like uh, actively looking for tops online which were like longer and weren't like really cropped uh, because i think i again like just grew out of that phase uh, so i wore a lot of body suits this year tops that were below my waist so this is the top that i found on h&m i really like this top it's very very cool there was this like whole thing of like sheer clothing um and i thought this was still modest but had that sheer sort of a thing it's not like see through see through but also like taps into that category so yeah i love this i got this from zara i really like like skin fit and like body hugging tops uh, and i like to wear like my trousers very loose that was the theme for this year <laughs> that has been the theme for a really long time and i think that's just my personal style because i feel the most comfortable and most confident when i wear such clothes uh, so yeah i wore a lot of these i also wore like peplum tops even with tank tops i did not wear them as much uh, but i remember i used to wear a lot of tank tops um like couple of years ago i was like a you know ganji girl <laughs> Uh, that sounds wrong but you know what i mean not like bald but like i preferred ganjis a lot so this year continuing the trend and you know my obsession again i don't think so i'm that obsessed now but yeah i preferred a uh, longer top so i got like longer tank tops as well these skin fit tops from and kind of like dupes of skims uh, i got it like at the end of 2023 and i fell in love or uh, i've worn them so 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 much so i got these ones from again zara love 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 them they're so soft and so nice and they give you a very like i don't know it just makes me look and feel very good i think my my style is also really basic which i personally really like and i think it never really goes out of style if i want to experiment i'll experiment with pieces um that are just an add on like maybe a jacket like a cardigan or something like that but i wouldn't really uh, change the actual silhouette that i have in mind it will of like always be very basic uh, and something very easy to put on talking about crop tops i did wear them at the start of the year uh, before i discovered my love for longer tops or the obsession began i think later on in the year but initially i did wear crop tops so i have uh, like the striped ones um but with crop tops i never really went uh, 
on with something that was like a lot uh, trendy i still uh, stuck to my you know basic and classic pieces so again this one with like black trousers looked so so chic in my opinion and so many of you guys asked me where did i get this from again from zara most of my wardrobe is from zara and also h&m little bit but yeah then i talking of crop tops i also wore like skin fit tops at the start of the year a lot i i, I went a little crazy and got them in so many colors but I ended up wearing only black and white or uh, and also <laughs> gray <laughs> for the sake of this video i thought that i should wear a different color so i wore this one but yeah now i'm i'm really like i've grown out of this i'll probably wear this to gym um because yeah, i don't see myself wearing it as much it's also a little too too cropped like it literally just ends uh below my boobs a little bit <laughs> so yeah it doesn't really cover up too much so i think i'm just like growing out of that phase now um talking of crop tops i also got uh, got i also wore a lot of crop shirts now this i think was really something that i wore a lot and i also want to keep wearing them a lot because i think it's just like really chic to wear like crop shirt with trousers or like jeans or whatever but majorly with trousers even with cargos it would look good oh shit i forgot to mention cargos i also wore cargos uh, quite a bit this year but not so much i think there was this one beige colored one from h&m because i think cargos don't really flatter my body type that much that is why i think i did not include it in this video but i did did wear that one particular one quite a bit this year okay talking about crop shirts so this is the one that i got from west side i uh, love it so 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 cool um it obviously um, i this is just what i feel i think they had like proper shirts or fir jab crop shirts ka trend nikla they just like cut it off i tried to like resell it that's just what i feel because uh the fit of this is kind of weird i mean it's nice but it's not like as oversized or baggy as i would like i literally had to size up i had to get a large <laughs> size in this uh, to just make it look a little oversized and as you can see in the try on clip it's still not up to the mark it would have been a little more easy and like just yeah like a little bit oversized so i think these these are like a proper tops and they cut it off that's what i feel okay then i also had this one again in blue and a pretty cropped i got this from h&m but fir iska kya ho gaya i galti se washed it with uh, my green dress and uh, yeah it just like the color bled through or fir iska thoda sa color off ho gaya so i did not wear this as much but yeah i it's nice i mean isko kafi maine bleach and sara kuch kara hai so i hope that i like finally get like proper color and then fir i'll start using this again um again i wore a lot of shirts like a lot of shirts especially when i go um and visit my native place i love to wear shirts because it's baggy and it's just like more appropriate in my opinion so i love wearing these satin shirts um but oversized satin shirts so this is the one that i wore so much this year like i cannot even tell you this is literally the shirt that i must have worn at least once every single week which is a lot um so yeah i've gotten a lot of use out of this shirt <laughs> this is what it looks like it's pretty cool and i also have another one in tie dye and another one in just like stripe so yeah it's also like i wouldn't say silk silk but like you know it's it's polyester basically but it has a silk finish or like a satin finish to it so this is that and yeah i again enjoyed wearing this a lot I used to wear a lot of like ankle length jeans and mom jeans and i still genuinely really love mom jeans because they are so comfortable and that's i don't know the silhouette is just something that i really really like on myself and i think my body and just, i just feel a lot co comfortable and confident whenever i wear mom jeans or like um, you know ankle length slim jeans from h&m so i used to wear them a lot uh, but for matlab mom jeans so i like it but for ankle length jeans i i thoda got bored and i was like oh i don't know i don't like I, <laughs> them so much and fair i discovered bell bottom jeans now i'll tell you a story with bell bottom um i remember 2000 mein there was like a, this whole trend and my my friends actually used to wear even though i was like really young back then but still i saw people wearing it and i never really liked it because they were like very very like low waist like low cut jeans or like just low cut pants low waist pants are not for me and then i discovered these pants on h&m the reason why i got them were, was because where is it 
Did I not get it? Guys, give me a minute. I'll just go. Two thousand years later. Here we are. Because I just tried it on for you guys. Okay. So uh, these pants I got uh, from Asian. And the reason why I got them that's because it said high waisted and I was like oh wow I should like give it a try these are not like bell bottom bell bottom but they are in my opinion but it said uh, the I don't know what's the difference maybe bell bottom are like a lot wider but these are like flared jeans and I got them and I was like wow and these were such a steal these were for only for like $14.99 and I was like man I've got these since the time I've got these jeans I haven't stopped wearing them I have been wearing them again literally every single week and I've loved them so much. Oh my god. I, I want to buy like every color possible in these pants. But Sara out of stock hota hai hamisha. So be on a lookout if you want these pants. Oh, uh, that's it. Those were all the things that I wore the most this year. Oh shit, I forgot again. This top. <laughs> the bodysuit that I'm wearing. Again, I did say that I wore a lot of bodysuits. And I think I've grown out of my tank top phase. And now I'm into like strappy tops. But more on like bodysuit again like longer tops i think that's the phase that like a lot of tops in my wardrobe currently uh and i'm also like always on the search for new ones to add on to it wherein i want like longer tops because yeah that's just that's just what i'm vibing with recently anyway so those are all the pieces and uh, those are all the things that i wore the most uh in 2023 let me know what did you wear the most in 2023 and uh, yeah let's have fun chat in the comment section and also let me know what do you want to watch more on the channel one of my biggest resolution for this year don't say it don't say it don't say it no i'll, I'll still say it because if i say it out loud i'll probably keep doing it so uh the resolution for this year is to be more regular on YouTube and just create more and consume less, I guess. So yeah, should I like make a video wherein I talk about my resolution for the year? Uh, let me know. There are like so many videos that I have personally like planned for this year. I hope that I'm able to execute all of them. But yeah, um, if you have any more ideas, let me know in the comment section. And uh, that being said, I'll see you next time. I'll also link all the products in the description bar below so you can go ahead and check that out and yeah having said that i hope you enjoyed today's video and if you did then you know the drill like share comment and also subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i'll see you next time bye